Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be bringing you another thrift haul, and this will be home goods and some clothing. And I know it's been two weeks since my last video. I've been busy with work and setting up my Etsy shop. And if you haven't visited my shop, please do so. I'll leave a link down below. And if you are not subscribed to my channel, please do so and give it a thumbs up. I'll try to post as much as possible. And if we're not friends on Instagram, please go ahead and like at Cashmere Junkie, and I'll leave it right here. And if you like to see what I got, please keep on watching. First, I'll start off with all the clothes that I got, which is not that much if I think about it. Maybe it's like three or four pieces or less. I'm not sure. It's, sorry. I have this giant basket full of stuff right now. Giant basket. First item is this almost crop top looking peasant shirt and it's cotton or gauze like you can see through it it had the tag in it but it fell off but it's Jen's pirate booty and I thought this would be super cute to wear during the beach with my swimsuit or maybe a renaissance fair next year since I missed it this year so sad but it's super cute and it has some stretch to it at the bottom. Next, I bought this BB Dakota lace dress. Super cute. I think they're still selling it on the website. And sorry, this was $2.99. This was $5.99 brand new with tags. The day I got it was a um, discounted day for purple tags. I don't know if you can see that. So that's super cute. As I break more stuff. Next I got this Madewell blue Eyelet dress, I think that would be, or yeah, super cute, super blue, cute for the 4th of July. And this was $4.99. Okay, don't mock me, but I found this really cute jammy top, but it has all little princesses on it and I thought it was so cute and it's by Disney brand new with tags and this was only $1.99 and since it's super hot right now I thought that would be great to go to sleep in last clothing item are these Kurt Elliott mint jeans I don't know if the camera is capturing the color but it almost matches my walls my walls are actually mint green but these are super cute these pants are usually $9.99 but my friend was there and she hooked it up so I only ended up paying five dollars for these jeans super cute they have zipper detailing at the bottom look cute with some wedges great for the summer so that's it for clothes Next, home decor. I found this skull, super cute. I wanted it when it was at Target and they sold out immediately when they went on sale and I purchased it for $8.99, super cute. I thought I could maybe hang my bracelets on it. Like that. Or my sunglasses, just a sec. Maybe my sunglasses on there. They won't hang. But maybe I should wear them for the rest of the video. Oh, and these are Celine. Super cute. They're olive. You know, because I'm kind of olive toned skin. 
ignore me I'm just tired next I got another copper candle holder I know I got one of these in my last video but this one has little stars on it super cute I only paid 99 cents and I think it still has the original tags from before but it just needs a little cleaning and maybe a little plant in it and it'll be perfect I got this cute little rabbit wine stopper for 99 cents and it has some gold detailing in here if you can see that super cute I couldn't resist I like white rabbits like Alice in Wonderland and I think I might have a theme going on right now also got this vintage Alice in Wonderland wall clock I'm not sure if it works because it didn't have a battery in it but that could be replaced if it doesn't I only paid $2.99 for this and it's actually vintage from England has a sticker down below and super great because the movie just came out and I always like Alice in Wonderland I'm not sure what I would use this for but I did like the wood detailing and the coral paint at the bottom and this was only $1.99 I might just store bracelets in it Maybe some rings or possibly a plant or a candle. I don't know the purpose for this yet. It will find a home. Purchase these frames. They're five dollars. And I have a larger one that is currently getting a picture in it. Two of these frames and one of them actually has an autograph picture that I received from Dick Van Dyke. I will list it right here and this one will probably have Sandy Fox's um, one of her autographs that she gave me I don't know if you know who Sandy Fox is she is a voiceover actress for Rini or Chibi Usa from Sailor Moon I'm a big Sailor Moon fan if you don't know and she actually gave me a giant poster and a small card for my birthday met her at WonderCon she's a super sweet lady love her so, Next, I got this mini snow globe. Ooh, I'm in it. And it's Pinocchio with Figaro. And this was $3.99. This is kind of expensive for a snow globe, but I just had to have it. I'm a snow globe collector, especially when it involves Disney. Super enjoy Disney movies. And this was a great find. It's an acrylic makeup holder by Mary Kay. I'm not sure if you can see Mary Kay. By Mary Kay. This was one dollar. And this will probably hold my eyelashes and my dirty makeup brushes. Who knows? But that was a good find. And I got a dryer holder. I already have one of these, but since I have so many hair tools, like curlers and um, flat irons, I decided to purchase this, and this was $3.95, and I have the larger one that holds um, three items, but I thought this would be great to hold the breast, and I can just store it under the sink, or maybe hang it on the towel rack, who knows. So, got that. disaster right now. Try to store these somewhere and move it out of the way. Actually next I will show you the bigger stuff. I purchased two of these frames with chicken wire on it. It used to have um, clothespins but I pulled them off. I was actually intending to spray paint this today, but I wanted to show you guys. I want to spray paint the frame black and the wire gold. And this will hold all my 
sunglasses well and my samples from my Etsy shop I'm just gonna go over my desk hello and these were pulled off the price but these were two bucks a piece good find and it also has the piece to hang them so those are getting get super painted today I'd like to see how they look like after leave a comment down below and I'll post a picture next I got this signature soy beach house scented candle smells really good brand new I paid a dollar ninety nine next I got a set seven chalk markers for $2.99 I haven't really opened them I'm not sure if they're even dried out since they were taken from the store find out. Alright. More cash. So they look like this. Handmade modern permanent chalk marker, creamsicle, wisteria, magnolia, that's my finger, raven, sea, mist, and fern. $2.99 for these chalk markers and I do not actually have a chalk marker a chalk board that I want to use with permanent chalk markers yet but I will figure it out these are pretty cool colors the last of my smaller home decor items I purchased this um, pot holder and pot kidding I'm gonna put some succulents in it maybe some um, pencils I'm not sure if I want it on my desk or outside but this was only oh, $4.99 and I thought maybe I'd spray paint gold uh, triangles on it let me know down below I think it's cute how it is but maybe it needs some gold it's kind of plain super cool find for $4.99 Like I showed in the beginning, I also bought this gigantic basket, and this was only two ninety nine. I break more stuff, and that will hold all my towels in my bathroom. And last but not least is a stuffafia. I think that's how you say it ottoman and it is gold with black leather and it's obviously too big for me to show you because i'm sitting on the floor right now um, but i'll put a picture of it here and it still had the original tags on it and i think it was about 3.95 or less on the website but they wanted 60 at the goodwill and i break it down to 40 dollars so great find with tags on it super great condition and that's it for my thrift haul